It's been nine long months and shattered relics where I hit the highest ever hit on this game and over one year since I made 700 million GP in dead man mode. I need a challenge. I need something. With nothing scheduled until next year except... Hmm. Wait a minute. World first achievements. First to complete a quest. Boring. First to gain a pet. Pure RNG. First to hit a 99, never gonna play that long. First to kill a boss, yes, I'm back. Was that okay? Fine. And my bum? Did my bum look big? It's fine. You know, these pants are really tight, and eating 50 sharks a day just isn't helping my diet. The question is which boss to go for. There's going to be loads of people going for this, so it has to be the best strategy out there. Most bosses have a requirement, so there's only really a few options that I can possibly do. I could take on one of the Melly Barrow brothers, doing Priest in Peril to access Mauritania first, and then kiting one around the room, maging it. Highly risky though, with the quest also requiring 50 pure essence, which would be a bit of a pain to get. The giant mole can be accessed immediately, and I could go and get some poison as a drop by safe spotting Ankus in the Stronghold of Security, and then put it on an Addy Spear I could buy in Core End. That would take a while to get though, and at low level attack, how often would I realistically hit the mole? There are two low level bosses that require keys, and I could do Waterfall to get 30 attack and 30 strength. But even with that, I would need to get very lucky to get a key drop quickly. And even then, at low level, they'd still probably kick my ass. So that just leaves the wilderness bosses, which can also be attacked immediately. But they all have huge defensive stats that a low level couldn't possibly hit through. Well, except one. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Am I ready? Probably not. <laughs> this is epic fail written all over it. But I'm going to try anyway. I've got my guy ready to go, even got level 3 and a few skills on Tutorial Island, for no other reason than I am just a massive tryhard. Let's go. Okay, plan A is to run straight to the Stronghold of Security. I'm not even stopping for wines or anything on the way. I need some money and I need a staff or I'm going to fail this challenge before I even start it. That's two chests on and 5,000 GP. I'm not even going to go for the 10k because making sure I get this staff is far more important. Please don't be out. Please don't be out. It can't be out yet, surely, can it? Yes. You ever known anyone so happy about a stupid staff and barrack in your entire life? I just need some runes here as well. Need a bunch of man runes and then a mix of the rest because I should, in theory, level up as I do this. And the tea seller here is going to sell me some nice tea that heals a whole three. Probably not enough of them, to be honest, but you'll have to do because that's all I have. I have level 3 magic, level 3 defense, 10 hit points, 1 prayer, a staff, some basic runes, and it's time to get my ass whooped. So last week I was testing all of the wilderness boss safe spots, and at a low level you just aren't strong enough, but one doesn't have a safe spot. There hasn't been a safe spot for the crazy archaeologist for 6 years now, because Jagex decided to patch every one that players found until there were none left. I tried to find one. So it looks like this edge is the limit of where the crazy arc uh, can go to, but I just can't get it stuck. It's not acting like most bosses, you know, when you go out of the attack range and they just retreat away from whichever direction you hit them in. He does walk back, but then he doesn't get stuck. He just kind of forgets about me and walks around like normal after a little while in a random direction. Even here, you think he's going to get stuck in the building, but he just doesn't. I've literally tried everywhere and it really gets stuck and it just doesn't stay stuck. This is the method that works on the other bosses where you get it to walk out of the area it normally patrols or it's normally in. And by doing that it gets broke and you can attack it from behind and it just doesn't work here. There you go. It just walks away. And even if it could do this way, to be honest, I can't tank this many hits from the boss with low HP. I think I have a method that could work, but it means tanking a hit to get him in position and then tanking another hit every time he gets unstuck. Sometimes he gets unstuck a couple of times, other times it happens a lot, and on a rare occasion, it doesn't happen at all. 
Oh, and by the way, his standard max hit is 14, and my health is... Um, yeah. I know. Great plan you got there, little ratbags. Good job. The worst part is I know there will be loads of players trying to do this right now, and I could easily do it quickly if I made three or four accounts, but that's lame, and I didn't want to do that. But if someone... If some snake, for example, mentioning no names whatsoever, pops up in my chat as a world first any second now, I will literally cry all over this video. I don't care. I'll be like the snotty child after he gets told Christmas is cancelled. <laughs> So I need to run across here and this is going to be my first tank test. Please be less than 14. No, you Wait, what? Where's the announcement? Where is it? Whenever someone gets a world first, we will broadcast it. I've only seen an announcement for two quests and there must be 10 plus different quests done by now easily. So I just think it's not working. Killed him another three times just in case it didn't register my first kill since I died a bunch of times and still absolutely nothing. Radio silence. I took a level 3 account straight from Tutorial Island to kill a boss in just over an hour. Possibly the fastest kill ever in the history of this game and almost certainly the fastest in this challenge. And you had one job to do, Jagex. Well, two. It's the same game. The only thing added was these announcements. That's all you had to do. Not like this, Jagex. Me and Wooks were going to go Wooks walking together after I did this. They were going to build a statue. Not like this. Jagged!